Hello everyone, I'm Augusta Myers. Let's take a brief look at what's been going on in City of Albuquerque related news lately. City leaders hosted a special media event last week announcing the citywide launch of Project Child Safe Albuquerque, an initiative designed to encourage responsible firearm ownership and promote secure storage of guns to help prevent accidents, thefts and other misuse. Law enforcement demonstrated safe gun storage methods and free cable-style gun locks and firearm safety educational materials were given out to local residents. The city of Albuquerque is taking the next step on an Amazon expansion by creating an intermodal transportation hub aimed at boosting the local economy. Recently, the Albuquerque City Council approved a ground lease and development agreement between the city's aviation department and Amazon. The agreement allows Amazon to develop an air cargo facility at the Albuquerque International Sunport. The city's integrated development ordinance has been updated. Now, when planning a building, designers and developers must show they've considered such effects as sun, shade, view, and position of the site and building design. City planners say these things will help achieve a built environment that is beautiful and that over time will cost less to heat and cool, providing a more pleasant environment for its occupants. The city's Economic Development Department and Office of Equity and Inclusion are two of only six recipients for Albuquerque Business First's Outstanding Diversity in an Organization Award. A panel of outside judges looked at how each nominee promotes diversity, equity, and inclusion within their organizations and communities, as well as what resources and programs they helped enact or champion to create more equitable workplaces. And that will do it for this week's City News for now. Be sure to join us again for our next installment right here on One Albuquerque Media. I'm Augusta Myers. Thanks for joining me.